Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long, and it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started, and we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Well, oh, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. Genk have chosen to go 4-3-3. Jim, how do you see it? Yeah, Peter, you can look at this formation one minute and think that it is 4-3-3, and the next time you check, it'll be 4-5-1. And it's all to do with whether you've got the ball or not, and the wider attacking players being asked to apply defensive discipline too. When it does turn to a five across midfield, then the shape of this team takes on a much tidier, compact defensive look. And that gets things running. Tries to get it forward quickly. Lovely bit of skill. This is promising. Has a pop! It's off target and by quite a way. Time to deliver. And now they can launch a counter. Out to the right. Pumps it into the area. Goes for goal! They score! There is the breakthrough! Well, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Genk grab an early lead. Good start. Well, that's where he wants it. Plays it out to the flank. Oh, tries one! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Oh, the least he could have done, Peter, was hit the target, and he's failed that test. Well positioned to make that interception. Genk. Oh, very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. Hoists it forward. Did well to step in there, that was more than necessary. Has he found his man? Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. And it's played forward. 
A chance to play it in. Into the box. Header! It's difficult to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Portray can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. And that's sprayed out wide. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Forward it goes. Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. Lobs it in gently. Aimed in towards the centre. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Driving on, he could shoot here. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Well, that's a foul, free kick's been given. Fence has got rid of that. Played out to the right. Oh, that's neat. Turns and goes back. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. Out to the right. The ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. And the first half is done. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Genk leading 1-0 at the break. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Genk going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Place it over to the other flank. Lovely feet. Towering header! He scored! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe! Genk are so well practiced in the art of keeping the ball through, wonderful passing and movement, and a real appetite to ensure it's reflected in their goal count. So that's two now without reply. The turning of the screw comes to mind, Peter. They've got them where they want them. Hoists it forward. Foot in. Loses his balance and loses the ball. What a good way to assert your authority for this second period. They were prepared to commit numbers forward into attacking positions, and the risk has been deservedly rewarded. Gets it back. Gets good distance on it.
They're looking at the referee, but he's waved play on. And it's played forward. Plays it out to the flank. Tries to get it forward quickly. Breaks on here. Plays it out to the wing. Managed to get it away. Up for a throw. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. So we have a double substitution going on here. He's in space and looking for options. Cross deflected behind for a corner. it away forward it goes hoists it forward cleared away that's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition it already has actually yeah now that he scored this defense is on high alert whenever he, he goes anywhere near the ball ball's loose who's getting there And once more, they can't get through. Played into space out wide. Timely intervention. Strike have just about everyone back and central. Yeah, clearly they're trying to show strength to what the opposition have seen as a weakness. It's a safety first approach. Hit into the middle. And that's been lever clear. Chance to break. Deftly done. And it's hoisted clear. Looks to bypass the midfield. And it's played forward. So that's it. It is all over. Genk will be very happy with a job well done. An efficient win, in which the players simply did enough. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Genk, a 